In today's video, we are going to be talking about Praynite, the meaning and spiritual properties of this lovely stone. Hello everybody and welcome to the Rock and Crystals channel. My name is AJ. So, Praynite is a pale yellow-green stone composed of calcium and aluminum, sometimes with iron in it, which can make the stone more orangish in color. Orange-ish in color. Most of the stones are a pale milky green blue. This is a stone of inspiration and unconditional love. It's a great stone for meditation as well, and it's helpful in treating gout and anemia. It's also beneficial for the kidneys, the bladders, the lungs, as well as the shoulders, the neck, and the chest. It aids in repairing connective tissue and can also aid in getting, the, getting to the root cause of an issue or dis-ease. Praynite connects you with your intuition or inner knowledge, which makes it an excellent stone for meditation. It will help you to find your truth and it will help you to stay on your path in life. It is also good for helping you to clear out things that you no longer need in your life so that you can open up space for other things to enter into. The chakras associated with Praynite include the heart and the third eye. Chakra and the astrological sign for the stone is Libra. The first discovery of Praynite occurred in 1788. Uh, Colonel Hendrik von Prain, who found it in Cape Province in South Africa. It was named after von Prain, a commander of the Dutch military forces in South Africa, and he introduced it into South Africa's gemstone trade. It has been used by shamans in South Africa for centuries before it was introduced to the Western world in the 1780s. You can mainly find Praynite in South Africa, but sometimes you can find it in Australia as well. Praynite is a popular cabochon material because of its beautiful colors. The colors on the stone range from greenish to greenish blue and even yellow or orange if there is iron in the stone. Totally transparent Praynite stones are very rare, but they can be found. The stone has a hardness rating of 6 to 6.5 on the Mohs hardness scale, and it can be made into fine jewelry. Large pieces of the stone have been found in New Jersey, and a piece that weighs 400 pounds has been found. Some specimens can go up to 30 carats. This is a wonderful stone to use for divination, which is to connect with our spirit or angelic realm. It is helpful in sealing and protecting your auric field, and it's good to have in the home for protection as well. You can use it when decluttering your home and letting go of possessions that you no longer need. It is useful in dream recall and dream recovery, and it helps to shine some introspective onto your dream world. So I hope you have enjoyed today's video on Cray Night. I hope to see everybody in the next video as we continue to learn more about rocks and crystals and gemstones. Have a great day. Consider dropping a like on this video if you liked it. It really helps this channel to grow and subscribe if you're interested in learning more about crystals because we are going to be talking about different crystals every single day. And if you're looking to buy crystals and gemstones, check out our Rockin' Crystal Shop linked in the description below. It definitely helps to support this channel when you shop for crystals at our shop. And lastly, we are doing a crystal giveaway from our Rockin' Crystal Shop every time we upload a new video you are allowed to enter into our crystal giveaway contest. All you need to do is leave a comment and let us know what you love about crystals. Also, be subscribed to this channel, and we will choose for every single video that we upload a random winner from our commenters to receive a lovely prize from our Rockin' Crystal Shop. You may enter into as many contests as you want. Every single video is a new contest, and I hope to see everybody in the next video.